Venify Code Sign Protect, part of the Venify control plane for machine identities, secures enterprise code signing. Code Sign Protect provides centralized and secure key storage with role based access control and policy enforcement. In this video, we'll be looking at signing executables using Sign Tool and PowerShell as examples. Code signing can also be applied to libraries and drivers, where we continue to see software supply chain attacks. InfoSec wants to stop malicious executables from being run within the enterprise. You want to run executables that have been signed as valid. However, signing code is slow and lacks strong control over critical private keys. But with Cosign Protect, signing code is fast and secure. Here we're logged into the Cosign Protect dashboard and have access to an executable code signing project. Code signing projects are used to govern the use of code signing keys. We have an assigned certificate and key and a key user who will be performing the signing of the EXE. This certificate was issued from an internal Microsoft CA. For externally consumed code, the certificate would be issued from a public CA. We'll start with a command line on a Windows 10 machine that already has the code sign protect client installed. In a Windows environment, you can take advantage of local security policies for EXE and DLLs. A popular policy enforcement engine in Windows is AppLocker. AppLocker rules specify which apps are allowed to run on the device. We've enabled the policy within AppLocker to only allow signed apps to run for trusted publishers. We have an application that's ready to be signed for final release. Let's run this EXE before it's signed. As you can see, it's blocked by group policy. We're running sign tool against a certificate called signer.sample.com and we're also using a timestamp for countersigning. Once signed, the executable runs successfully. If we look at its properties, you can see the name of the certificate under signer information. As an alternative, we can sign executables with PowerShell. We'll be using the same certificate and the set authenticode signature commandlet. Just like that, you have a valid signed EXE together with the thumbprint of the signer certificate. Using Venify Cosign Protect, your organizations can both sign and deploy executables securely to comply with InfoSec policy. By providing developers with agility and freedom of choice by fitting into existing workflows, Cosign Protect reduces the burden on development teams by integrating with the tools and processes they already use. Still have questions? Turn to Venify, the machine identity experts. Check out our channel or visit venify.com to learn about all things encryption, certificate management, and more.